What's up guys, Joe Snow right here. So in today's video I'm going to show you how you can sign forever an IPA that you deployed using CDI Impactor on a jailbroken device. And I'm going to explain about the immortal tweak, how it works and what are the limitations. So uh, there have been a lot of rumors about a tweak called immortal lately and I'm going to show you what about it. So uh, immortal in here is a tweak called by Ahmad made by Ahmad, sorry. And uh, if you install it, it will basically allow you to sign any IPA forever. You don't need to do anything. Simply the IPA will no longer expire after seven days of usage. This is pretty good. And that seven days of usage is something um, put by Apple in place for developers in order to make them, to force them to buy a um, another pack, for example, the $99 per year pack or the enterprise pack in order to sign their apps for one year. But of course, free users like you can deploy the uh, IPAs on the device, but only for seven days. Then it will expire and you need to do it again. Now let me explain what Immortal does. It will respring and I'm gonna be back. So the device resprung and now you can see I have Immortal installed. And what is this Immortal application doing? Well, in the description you can see that it prevents exploration of the signed iOS applications and bypasses the three free signed applications per device limit. So theoretically you can use now CDI Impactor to deploy as many applications in the IPA format as you want and as long as you're jailbroken they will no longer expire. You can use them for as long as you want and you're no longer limited to three apps per um, per week. So um, what is the caveat of this thing? Well, uh, it is a tweak, which means that you have to be jailbroken in order, in order for it to work. So uh, you cannot use it for Yalu jailbreak. Well, in fact, you can use it for Yalu jailbreak or Yalu dark, but unfortunately, because it requires you to be jailbroken, the tweak won't work in the first place if you restart your device in a non-jailbroken state, which means that if the application is Sign it side loaded and signed only for seven days. If you are jailbroken, using this tweak will never expire. But if you restart your device in a non jailbroken state, it will, it will expire. And uh, this means you cannot use it for Yalu itself. But Soric is creating something that will prevent you from um, being required to resign every seven days. So try not to install anything from the internet saying that it's one year uh, certificate for Yalu jailbreak and so on. So then if it doesn't work for Yalu, what you can use this thing for? Well, for example, I have Lilo application here. Lilo is an application that I created and it's signed of course using my certificate that is only available for seven days. By now the application should have expired, but as you can see I am able to open it and I am able to go and do whatever I, uh, I want to do with it. Because the tweak itself prevents the device from recognizing it as being expired. Of course if I restart the phone I will no longer be able to open Lilo if it's not jailbroken. But if I jailbreak I can open Lilo and any other application or game that I sideload via CDI Impactor yet again on the device. So this is how Immortal works. Unfortunately it doesn't prevent you from having to resign Yalu every, se every seven days if you restart your device. But as long as you don't restart the device and you keep it jailbroken then you won't need to resign any of the IPAs you deploy. And face it, Sometimes you don't find what you need in the App Store. There are plenty of the applications that you need to download from elsewhere in the IPA format or, I don't know, games or older versions of the applications that, that you can no longer find and uh, you need to sign them using CDI Impactor and this will prevent the um, certificate expiration. I really hope this works for you and I really hope uh, this explained how the, um, the tweak work. So do not forget it is a tweak, so if you're not jailbroken it won't work. But as long as you're jailbroken you will be out of any problems with resigning every seven days and with the three devices limitation. So this is basically it. I hope you understood how Immortal works. If you want you can check it out uh, on the description, the Immortal source code on GitHub if you're interested into contributing to it or if you're interested into looking on how it works. Until the next time, I'm Joe Snow. Drop a subscribe to this uh, video or to this channel, whatever, if you are yet to and give this video a thumb up if you liked it. If not, give it a thumb down. Tell me in the comment section down below what are your favorite IPAs that you deploy on your device and peace out.